Hello, hello. My name is Audrey Gangel. I'm trichologist, barber, and hairdresser. Today, the subject is traction alopecia, like the word is traction. Traction meaning that you are putting so many tensile and mechanical pressure on your scalp or your hair shaft. So now, how it can occur? It can occur the way you are hairstyling your hair or someone else are handling in the wrong way your hair. How can you recognize it? You can recognize the traction alopecia can be recognized by the parties in some area on the hair where you are putting so much and constant pressure, constant stress, and that can occur in the perimeter, on the temple, or behind the ear. So now, when you see that you are putting so many stress in that area, and you begin noticing that your scalp is being a little transparent, you have to worry about going to the traction alopecia. It can be due to many factors. First of all, traditional method of hairstyling. In the black community, we have so many breads. We have beautiful, beautiful hairstyle, but sometimes we have that traditional uh, style that puts so many pressure on the hair. And we have the over bleaching the root of our hair, the tight styling. We have the way we are combing our hair and the state when we are combing it, the way we are drying our hair, the way we are using the heat on our hair, many ponytails, and sometimes we are putting so many products, so many gel, so many wax on our hair that when you wash it normally, you can sometimes, after tightening it so much, you can cause traction alopecia too. We have the good news. If you have a traction alopecia, it could be performed clinically. Why? Because clinically, using trichogram or trichoscan, we could exclude other disease. So you have to enjoy today because if you are having traction alopecia, go to your trichoscan, not going to, to the clinic, not going to the uh, trichologist consultation if you notice it by yourself that you are putting so many pressure on your hair shaft or your scalp, you have only to interrupt the trauma, to discontinue it. Because if you are not stopping what you are doing right now, you are not having traction alopecia anymore, but you are having a chronic alopecia or scarring alopecia or permanent hair loss. In that case, the only thing you can do is a surgical, is a surgical um, intervention. You can grow your hair naturally. You can stop putting so many pressure on your fiber because we have a beautiful fiber. We have beautiful hair and your, your trunk, your hair. Also, if you don't have it for many, many, many reasons, but when you have it, you have to know about what to do on your hair because you have a number of follicles when you're born and you die with, with that number. You can grow your follicle, but you can grow your hair. So if you remove your follicle, you can have a natural grow anymore. And if you have enough money, you can go to the surgical for it. The good news is stop doing what you are doing now that causing traction allocation. See you in the next video and I will speak about alopecia reata.